Section A, A Little History. Algebra is a sort of universal arithmetic that replaces numbers with letters. Next to geometry, algebra is the oldest form of mathematical study. Records written in ancient Egyptian, Arabic, and Chinese show that all of these cultures explored aspects of algebra. Algebra was developed to solve practical problems dealing with astronomy, architecture, and property. Fortunately for us, the ancient Egyptians, Chinese, and Arabs did all the work in developing algebra, and we just have to follow their lead. The English word algebra actually comes from the Arabic words algebra, meaning the coming together of parts. One of the most common purposes for algebra is solving for x, or defining a variable. That is where you will spend most of your time in algebra and on your tests, solving for x. And that is where we will spend our time together. And that is why I have stolen it from Ohio Bones. You can think of an algebra problem as a jigsaw puzzle that's missing one piece. But just because you're missing a piece doesn't mean you can't put the rest of the puzzle together. And once you fit the pieces that you do have together, you can see the size and shape of the missing piece. So you'll be able to recognize that piece when you see it. Finding that missing piece, the x variable, is the core of algebra. So we see that the object of algebra and my own life's mission is the noble and unrelenting quest for the unknown variable, x. Well, class, it's time for me to go now. Put your homework on my desk.